So there they were, three K-pop idols shining brighter than my future, basking in the glory of fan love. I mean, can you blame them? With supporters showering them with love, it's like being in a never-ending relationship without actually having to remember anniversaries. Seriously, where's the downside? I bet even their shampoo is envious of how much love they get. Maybe I should start a fan club, but who am I kidding? My only fan is my cat. And don't you just love how they effortlessly balance being glamorous superstars while looking like they just rolled out of bed? You gotta hand it to them. While I'm over here trying to find a matching pair of socks, they're casually setting a fashion standard. Next time I go to the grocery store, I might just throw on a bucket hat and pretend I'm off duty too. It's all about that just woke up like this vibe, right? Is it just me or does every photo of K-pop idols look like a scene from a romantic drama? All that's missing is dramatic music and a slow motion filter where they catch butterflies flying around. Like, come on, they should probably get royalties for every day they exist because clearly they're making the world a better place just by smiling. But wait, does that mean I can sell my selfies too? I should start charging. I'll call it an artistic vision. The interaction between these stars and their fans could just cure any bad day. I mean, who wouldn't feel like they're on cloud nine after receiving a wink from Jungwoo or a smile from Hwasa? It makes me question my life choices. I could either try to live vibrant, go to the gym and party like an idol, or I can keep scrolling through photo after photo of fan encounters, eating chips on the couch. Tough call, isn't it? You see, these celebrities don't just exist in a vacuum. They have the power to make us feel less miserable about our nine to five grind. Sometimes I wonder if they even know how much joy they bring. I mean, here I am cheering them on from my messy living room with my only credential being my vast knowledge of their discography. Imagine a diploma in K-pop fandom, giving you the right to fangirl without judgment. Where do I sign up? And isn't it funny how we turn into mushy puddles just watching them interact with their fans? Like, I could watch hours of these charming encounters contemplating the deeper meanings of life. Meanwhile, what's really happening is I'm just imagining a scenario where I win a meet and greet. Spoiler alert, it involves me tripping and spilling my drink. Can someone please role play with me? Maybe I need some practice for that future life-changing moment. But you guys, here's my burning question. If you magically turn into a K-pop star for a day, what's the first silly thing you'd do with your fans? Would you serenade them with an off-key rendition of your hit song? Or maybe offer them snacks and awkwardly dance in front of them? I mean, let's be real. The possibilities are endless and probably hilarious. So what's your dream fan interaction moment? Like and subscribe, please.